Okay guys, so I promised you that I would sketch this design out for you so that if you don't have a Cricut or you can't do this by hand without a little bit of extra help, I wanted to help. So this is my most recent tutorial. It's called Summerstone. So I'm going to show you quickly how to sketch this onto your stone or your canvas or whatever it is you're painting on so that there's nobody left out. It's a fairly easy design. So I'm gonna start with a circle. You don't need a perfect circle. You can use a compass um, or, or whatever it is that you wanna use. Um, now I'm putting five dots on top and try to place them right where I'm putting them, four on the bottom. So there's nine dots all together. Now in between these dots, this doesn't look like that design, I know. Don't worry, don't worry. In between these dots, you're gonna do like long petals, just like in the design. Then I'm going to use a compass and put a dot in the center of my circle and draw around to make sure all my petals are the same size. Now I'm doing this with pencil so that I can erase everything I don't want afterwards. And, and you know, then you do all the fixing right after that. So I'm making sure all of my petals extend out. I'm trying to do them the same size, but nobody's perfect and I'm not using any special tools. So of course they are going to be a little bit wonky and that's okay. It's still going to be beautiful. So these lines are going to be super thick anyway. Um, so don't worry about how messy they look. We're going to be putting a thick coat of paint over that. Um, but I'm just sketching it out. This is just a sketch. Um, so now you drag those ends down at the tips of your, your petals. You drag those down and make another circle. Make sure that they're all the same size. Then you get out your half teaspoon or half tablespoon and use it as a little guide to swing from tip to tip with your pencil. Now, of course, this is a real quick sketch um, and it was last minute. I wasn't going to do it, but then I thought, you know what? A lot of people don't have a stencil. So let's make, let's make this together. Now you can slow this video down, but make sure you mute me because I sound like an intoxicated monster <laughs> and it's not pleasant. It is actually quite scary. So as you can see, I'm going to paint in the bits that I want to keep. I'm just doing this on paper because like I said, it's a sketch and I'm not even going to finish it because it's just a sketch and I'm just showing you how easy it is to create one of these by yourself without having a silly Cricut machine or a stencil. Um, it's actually quite an easy design and you can put it as big as you want and as small as you want, um, but you will need a compass um, to make those circles to make sure all your petals are the same size and all of that. But you end up with this, you erase all the parts you don't want and then you start dotting uh, just like I did in the Summerstone tutorial. Now, of course, there's going to be cleanup. You're going to want to fix everything to make sure all your lines are approximately like the same thickness. And there's some black you might have to cover back up with white again so that your, your white doesn't have black all over it in certain spots. You're going to make mistakes. So always do your cleanup and make everything precise and, and the way you like it before you start adding color like you see in the Summerstone tutorial. I love you guys. I hope this helped. I hope that you are all enjoying the bright colors that I've provided you with today. Um, and I want you to keep painting. That's all that matters. I will be back soon. I love you. Bye.